the good people. I just had a student of mine about two days ago, my DMs asked me, hey, how do you reach out to clients and get web development, web design clients for your agency, right? So I've made videos on this, but I'm just going to recap in this video to make it as short as possible. I'll try to put links to the other videos in the description. But the, the real way you need to get clients as a web designer, web development um, guy, you do web development, you do web design, create apps, you create like other web solutions, right? So the real thing you need to focus on is having portfolio projects, right? And it's the same thing. That's the funny, funniest thing about making money online or doing online businesses, online service businesses, right? Even products, if you're selling products, you need reviews, right? For service businesses, you need portfolio projects that you've done, whether it's like real clients, whether it's like fake clients or full projects. You need projects. You need a lot of them, like three, four, five. And they need to be of the highest quality. So you can't just put like some garbage to your um, portfolio projects in whatever you're having. You need to have good quality portfolio project, right? So if you're trying to get clients in a specific industry, you need to have portfolio projects that are in that specific industry also. For example, if you're trying to get clients for like um, education, you need to have like three or four or five websites, apps, um, custom tools you've done for education pro um, businesses, similar to the one you're trying to reach out to or the one you're trying to land. So it just makes it so easy for them because they'll be like, hey, this guy has helped someone similar to me. Why can't I just, why can't I just hire him to help me? Right? He's, he already has experience because no one wants to actually teach from scratch something that you can just get someone else to do and pick it up from there and just run with it. Right? So that is extremely important. You need to have portfolio projects. And the second thing you need to do is as a beginner, you need to drop your prices. Right? People charge $2,000, $5,000 for like web design projects, web development projects right? in total. What you need to do is you need to drop it to like $300 to like $500. Right? Don't do free trials, especially for like web, de web development because it doesn't really help a lot. But for um, web design and stuff like that, you can just do um, a price point of like 300 to 500, right? So once you have a price point of like 300 to 500 dollars, you can just use that to get even better clients for your agency, right? So it just works in full circle, right? It comes in full circle. So what you need to do is you can drop your prices as a beginner. You can drop your prices and just essentially. Uh, like use that to get a lot of doors open, get a lot of like trust barriers to drop because a lot of people don't trust you at the start. So what you can do is you can drop your price to like three hundred to five hundred dollars, have a good delivery time frame then. Once you do that, you can then get a lot of clients because a lot of guys they don't want to hire a beginner that charges a lot of money. So he he has to like um he has to like even out somewhere, right? So what you can do is you can just drop your prices to like three hundred to five hundred dollars then you can get a lot of clients. Then once you get those clients, you can then increase your prices, right? Once you go to like three to five clients and you know that, okay, you don't need the money right now. Like you're out of the desperate stage as a freelancer. You're like, you're good for now. You can then increase the prices to like whatever you want to increase it to, right? So that's extremely important also. Then the third thing you need to do is, um, this also goes hand in hand with like the first point I made, right? And, but the, th the third thing you need to do is you need to have a clear, um, and how to explain this? You need to have a clear and consistent website, right? You need to have like a website that shows all of your stuff, in that, right? And this website needs to be clear. You don't need to have like a lot of fancy animations because that's what a lot of freelancers do. Instead of doing the stuff that actually makes them to close more deals, they focus on animations, they focus on crazy effects, they focus on everything except what actually matters, right? I'm not saying you shouldn't do the fancy stuff, you, sh you shouldn't do like the effects and all of that, but that is after. It, sh it should be like, the, the uh, sprinkling on top. It shouldn't be like a foundation. You shouldn't make your website for your freelance agency, your web, or your SMA, uh, whatever, and just make it all fancy. Make it all like hover text, and make it all fancy, and make it all hover text and crazy stuff like that. And no one can actually find your email. No one can actually look at your pricing structure. No one can actually see what you're about or where you're from or. No one can actually see where you're from and stuff like that. So you need to lay your eggs or lay the, the cart after the horse. You don't need to lay the cart. You need to lay the cart after the horse, not the cart before the horse. You need to do the important things first, then the like less important things last. The most important thing is having a good website that has a good structure. People can locate you, they can locate what you do and all of that. Then the next and the least important parts are having a website that actually has all the fancy effects and all of that that can wow your clients, right? So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you guys get more clients using this method I've talked about here.
I hope you guys enjoyed this video and you can use this um, methods I've talked about in this video, three methods to get more clients for your agency. Drop a comment down below if this has worked for you. And I'll catch you also in the next video, daily uploads. Peace.